I parried that at the same time I got hit. What the fuck is this? What am I looking at? What? Yo! The legendary chalice has an urgent message for you. Find me on the coast, cups. Finally. I have not been waiting long, gonna be honest, but I'm glad that the DLC is finally out. Mugman is fucking dead. Hello there. Extra extra chef salt baker award best baker in all the lands. Oi! You're them caps that took out the devil, ain't ya? This aisle's tough. If you send that imp packing, you got suitcases to spare. Here pals, take a little moolah for doing the world a favour. This guy is awesome. Good to see Pork Rind is still in business. Come. The King's Leap. What's this? Hello there. What the fuck? Hello. This is a bit weird. <laughs> hey all ye cups, I bid thee welcome to my floating palace. I'm the one true king. The king of games. From afar I have seen the battle with zeal and aplum. What the... What? See new battle with zeal and aplomb. Who the fuck is... Who is that? Who is zeal and aplomb? And lo, I grant thee a place in my royal tourney. In these bouts, your weapons and charms shan't be of use. You'll have to find different means to best my champions. From victories, riches, now into the fray with haste. Uh... Sure. <laughs> sure thing. I thought they said that might. Okay. Oh, I, I see. This is weird. I thought they said that my charms wouldn't do anything. But Miss Chalice herself is indeed a charm. Can the other two come down? What the fuck is this? <laughs> This is, this is so weird. What the, you dispatch that champion in so few rounds, brave cups. Thy reward, wealth. Two coins. Furthermore, I permit the special entry into the next match. Oh. This is a cool background, I'll say that much. What is this? Oh, okay. Hello there. What's he doing? Oh, he wants me to get close. Come on, then. It's so dumb. Stop! Little shit. A W for me and an L for you. My man really said take this fucking L. What a stupid horse. What a stupid horse. I hate this guy. <laughs> this, is, this is weird. I like this guy though. Okay, so you can jump. When he does that, you can jump over and parry his head. I see. That's probably where I'm going to be attacking him the most. Come on. Come on. I'm right here! Okay, well that... This is kind of rude. How many times do I have to parry this guy? I'm not doing this shit. I'm not doing this shit. This, is, this guy's boring. 
I like you literally just have to fucking, I don't know, walk close to him. Wow, that's really cool, isn't it? Fuck you, bitch. Come. What the fuck is this? I forgot about this. What is happening? Okay. I, I'm i taking time to, to realize what's happening, and honestly, I have no fucking clue. Geese King. Okay. That's cool, man. Thank you for Geese King. What's happening? <laughs> what, is, what is happening? I'm so confused. <laughs> What's he doing? Oh. Oh. He's dead. What is happening? Oh, I can stand here now. This is certainly something. <laughs> I'm so... Okay, his hands are dead. That's unfortunate, isn't it? Oh, and now he's really... Oh. I'm not comfortable with this. This is certainly not what I expected. <laughs> I'm not sure. Not sure how I feel about this one. I'm... Uh, I'm so confused. Oh, that's it. That that's, that's the game, baby. First try. Nothing changes. <laughs> I was just... I was just confused that entire time. Chalice! Snow Colt Scuffle. I've seen this one uh, in the trailers. They, they showed this one a lot I, uh, for some reason. Yo, wizard guy. This guy is so awesome. What's he doing? I'm killing his children. Ring, ring. And now he's, now he's a spooky guy. What the fuck? What is that? Oh. Swords. And now he's a fucking fridge. I'm so confused with all of these. <laughs> oh my god. This is taking so much brain power to realize what's happening. I'm going to be honest. Oh my god. Suck my peen. Suck my peen. I... Okay. I've played enough Hollow Knight to know how to dodge those. Nightmare King Grim got me fucked. This is certainly a weird fight, I'll say that much. And now he's a now he's a, a snowflake. I didn't mean to do that. Ah, what is hitting me? A uh, question. I didn't see what hit me, which is unfortunate because I might die. No! How close was I? Nearly first try again. I like these. I like these. They are, I thought they were going to be a lot tougher, though. Oh my god, he hit his kid out of the onto the fucking screen. Okay, I'm back up here with two hearts, except for I know what I'm doing this time. Okay, I'm not sure what that is. Okay, so I don't. I don't actually know what I'm doing. I lied. Okay, so cool. <laughs> it's Aura Boreal over for you. That's pretty funny. This guy, this guy, this snow cone is a funny guy. I I forgot what I was doing there for a second. Just let the whale wank on me. That's not what happened, actually. <laughs> I didn't do anything like that, actually. I love this guy. This golem guy is so awesome. I don't like the snow cones. Yeah, the sn Oh, and he's dead. It's fine. Doesn't matter if I like the snow cones, because he's dead. Hello, ghost. Say, young fry, I'm hot on the trail of a mystery, but I'm stumped. That contest of skill, that broken artifact, this eerie graveyard. I have discovered potent astral energy in all of these places. There must be an order and method to it. To fucking... To what, my guy? Moonshine mob bootlegger boogie. Is this the spider? It is. This spider was in trailers. I don't know if you guys have seen any of that. But this spider was in trailers for the game. And then they cut it out. So this guy has been in development for a while, I guess. God damn, what the fuck? My man's barely holding on. What is happening? 
Can I... Oh, wait, no, I know this. This is another piece of cut content. This was just a boss in, like, uh, one of the things. You can't... I remember this. Why did they... This is a weird thing that they brought back. I'm going to be real. But I like it. I want this bitch to die. Thank you. Oh. Big guy. Uh, I, something tells me that's not true. Yeah, I didn't think so. I didn't think so. I saw right through your deception, you stupid little shit. I am no fool. I do not take fake knockout. I, I do not accept a, f a fake knockout screen. I only accept it once the results are in. That can really catch you off guard if you, if you don't realize though. High Noon Hulapa. Oh, High Noon Hoopla. Okay, cool. Oh, it's a plane level. I hate plane levels. What the fuck? Okay, so she has different we- oh, There's so much happening on screen. What the fuck, actually? There is so much happening on screen. That actually, like, hurt my brain. I was not expecting so much to just appear on my screen as soon as I started this. Okay, and now she goes down here. She shoots oil, I guess, and then it becomes a snake thing. That thing drops dynamite. She does that. Uh, this is this is more what I was expecting when I saw, you know, the trailer. Okay, cool. This is actually killing me. <laughs> this is killing me to coordinate. My brain hurts from this. Okay, I like this one more. Oh. I'm a naval bomb. I see. I parried that at the same time I got hit. What the fuck is this? <laughs> what am I looking at? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Why is she? Why did she turn into sausages? What the fuck? <laughs> that is the absolute. Okay, I need to be careful of the cactus there. That is the absolute last thing I expected when I saw her die. That is the literal last thing I thought would happen here. What the fuck? Oh, I see. That's pretty cool. Okay, well, I wasn't paying... I was too busy paying attention to that shit. And now she's sausages because her cooker ate her, I guess? This is a confusing fight. I think the first phase is probably the one I'm going to hit the most on. She has snake oil. That's funny. Okay. That. Oh, I get it. I get it now. Okay. That's why they turn it into snakes. It's snake oil. I get it. I get the joke. And then I watched her do her really long wind up and it still hit me. Oh, and now she's... Now she... Just when I actually thought it couldn't get any fucking weirder. She is now a literal tin can of food. She's, she's just been murdered. She's actually just been murdered. A gal can enjoy a moment's peace without you meddling. Oh, can't enjoy. I fucking hate this woman. She just keeps making puns. Can she shut the fuck? This is... This is just weird. <laughs> this is just a very weird fight, if I'm honest. And this first phase causes some, like, sensory overload in me. I'm not gonna lie. I have to pay attention to so much shit going on. Let's be frank here. I'm your work. She, I think she has a pun for every single fucking stage. Worst nightmare. Can't enjoy the snake oil fucking pit. This entire fight, this entire boss fight is just one big pun. This literal entire boss fight is one giant reason just to make a bunch of fucking like old western timey fucking puns. That's literally it. That's this whole boss fight. And I'm not sure if I love it or I hate it. I think my problem was that I was staying right next to her and I meant to stay like here. 
Thank God. Fuck that woman. God damn, I hate that cow. That cow kind of sucked. Oh, I move the, the plane. Oh, I see. That's fucking dumb. I don't like that. I like that they bought this guy back, but honestly, this is a bit weird. Okay, the dogs. I'm killing the dogs. They're just, they're just woofing the alphabet at me. That's certainly a phase, like, what the fuck? Now this is cool. What the shit? I was meant to parry that, but I just kind of, what the? Oh, I don't like this at all. I don't like this at all. I... This is so hard to, to think about what is happening right now. Oh, this is even worse. Okay. No, I, I like this boss, actually. I, I'm saying it sucks, but I do actually like this boss. It's fun. Although I might be complaining, I do actually like it. I don't, I don't, I didn't like the cow lady. This fight is unique, and I do actually like it, even if I might complain about it. I'm simply complaining because I'm bad, is the thing. I like the uniqueness of this boss. Like, the final phases... Uh, weapons are pretty easy to dodge, but it's just the fact that you're upside down that's kind of making it difficult, right? They didn't make it too difficult and upside down. And this phase isn't actually as hard as I thought. I was just paying attention to the wrong things. I don't know why they included this phase, but, you know, they did. This, this, is, a, this is a fun fight, I have to say. I am enjoying myself. I actually like this a lot. A lot more than I thought I would for some reason. <laughs> this is such a weird phase. This is so weird. They literally were just like, what if we just send dogs that shoot the alphabet at you? Oh my god, please. Please. Yes! Yes! <laughs> And the guy's cheering. The guy's cheering for me. Thank you, guy. I mean, that that was actually all the bosses. I, I got through it all today. That wasn't actually as, as difficult as I thought it would be. It took me about an hour to beat all of those guys. The pineapple mint. Well, I've got all the stuff. We did it. That was the last ingredient we needed for the wonder tart. Let's get back to salt baker. Lickety split. Something tells me it's not going to be as easy as that. Is there going to be like a, a, a final boss, I feel? Like, is the baker going to be like, haha, I'm actually the final boss? That seems like something that would happen, you know? I hope it doesn't, because this guy's cool looking. Oh. Okay, so I can fire. I've got my HP. And there's a very ominous... Uh, trap door. I'm sure this is fine. Hello. Yeah, this just this doesn't seem evil at all. Welcome back, you meddlesome br Okay, well that's rude. I didn't think you'd be back so soon. No matter, it's too late to stop me now. The Wonder Tart will be my finest work yet. A shame I never told you about the most important secret ingredient. A living soul. While you suckers were out there doing my bidding, I nabbed your little friend here. When his soul is baked into the Wonder Tart, the cosmic powers from the astral plane will be mine. Cuphead, Mr. I'm playing as Mugman. Um, okay. But first, I'll take those ingredients and then I'll use your heads as serving dishes. I don't know how I called that this guy would be evil, but, I mean, I did. I'm glad he is, because honestly, I kind of felt a bit let down that that's all there was. This is certainly a, a, a lot going on right now. Okay, I just walked right into that one. I'm going to hope I don't have to worry about what's happening in the background, and that he doesn't just randomly, like, fucking... Like, grab a knife and just stab me in the fucking face. 
Okay, this seems like a new phase. Oh. Hello. Oh, so I have to kill the, the salt shakers and then they just they whack him in the face. That's actually awesome. My power grows with much a a pl a plumb. A plum. Why is this guy using big words on me now? Your end is here upon my palm. So I'm gonna guess that it's meant to write. My power grows with much a balm. Your end is here upon my palm. I like that the, you beat the salt shakers and they literally just fucking fly into the guy's face. That was the wrong direction, actually. I, I hate to break it to myself. Oh, that fire really did just do that. And now he's punched in the face by some, some pepper, I guess. Do those leaves hurt me? I don't actually know. Ouch. My man is getting fucking pummeled right now. I feel like Miss Chalice would, like, <laughs> based on how she is in, in the in the show so far, I feel like if he just said, hey, Miss Chalice, if you don't stop me, I'm just, I'll let you, like, I'll, I'll make you alive again. Like, I feel like uh, she probably would just, like, let Mugman die. <laughs> if, I, if I'm honest, I feel like I feel like Miss Chalice would just let Mugman die. This is a cool fight. I have to say, I don't like the fire though. The fire is annoying. The little fire guy just dancing around. He sucks. I don't like him. Can he, yeah, go on your final phase. Oh, what is happening? Oh, wait, is this a snow guy again? What the fuck? What is happening? Okay. Oh, he is, has he turned into, like, sugar or some shit? What the hell? Was that a heart I could have collected? No, it's not. I don't know what is happening. Why am I parrying this fucking heart thing? Is my question. Like, why do I need to do that? I mean, I guess it gives me my... Okay, that should have been a parry. Oh, that's the final phase. That's just his heart. The mark of my salin sal salinity shall scar the thy fired glaze. What? The mark of my salinity shall scar thy fired glaze. That's not... That doesn't rhyme, but I mean... All right. I'm not resetting at all anymore. Because if I do, then we won't know my death counter by the end of this. And I will not accept that. Can I get... Can I beat the DLC before getting to 100 deaths, I think is the question here. And I think the answer is no. I think I've already got 100 deaths, but we'll see. Okay, so what happens in the background dictates what happens here. I didn't realize that. So, like, the, he chops up the limes, the limes come, he chops up the sugar, the sugar comes, and then he, he chops up the, the, the... He does that biscuit thing, and the biscuits turn into the horses, I guess. We're just ignoring the fact that he straight up murdered that biscuit and turned it into horses as well. I like how I said I'm not going to reset anymore, and then I reset. Your futile efforts were in vain. This world will be my salt. Oh, this is salt. This is disgusting. I thought it was like salt. Wait, no. I. This is salt. This is disgusting. I thought it was salt. No, I thought it was sugar. Or like snow. And he's dead. Thank God. What a bitch. What a bitch. That actually took me like 25 minutes, which I didn't think it would. Mugman. Thank goodness you're okay. Oh, Miss Chalice. That dastardly salt baker, he had us hoodwinked the whole time. Gazooks, this place is coming down. Let's get out of it. What is this shot? I actually like it. I do like this shot, but <laughs> at the same time, it's a bit weird. Look at her face. <laughs> Look at her face. She looks very, uh nonchalant about this 
It's just a minor inconvenience. Gazooks! This place is coming down. Let's get out of here. Eek. Well, that wasn't... Ah! No! My bakery! Serves him right for duping us. But with the bakery destroyed, you're never going to get that wonder tart, Chalice. That's okay. If some poor soul has to be sacrificed for me to live again, it just ain't worth it. But mark my words, boys, I'm never going to stop searching. And in the meantime, if you ever find yourselves in a scrape, I'm just one cookie bite away. Besides, who needs a wonder tart when they can have two best, two new best pals instead? The epilogue. Is it going to be like where everyone is now? It is. Good. Is that the bee? Did the bees just... Good. He's being sentenced to fucking jail. Community service. What's, what does he have to do? Okay, so moonshining is still illegal, so I'm not sure why community service has him doing that. Yo, the ice golem is in the background, just fishing. He's awesome, I love that guy. Oh, he has to paint the boat. He cries about the fact that his bakery is destroyed. Shouldn't she be in jail? I kind of wish she was, I hated that woman. Yo, the dogs. Probably the best boss fight this entire game, which I was complaining about, but it's actually awesome. I never saw the queen. I only saw the king. I gave up trying to kill the fucking horse. He's building something. Oh, is he rebuilding his bakery? He is, and he, he made cake, so it's fine. It's fine that he tried to kill Mugman because he made cake. It's actually fine. There we go, I did a three in a row, god damn. I styled on his ass. That was a very long fight, I have to say. Okay, so I just need to be careful of the ones that are on fire, I guess. I honestly don't know what's happening either. Like, I thought I'd, I'd be hit by the candles, so... Oh, I need to put out the candles. They don't hurt me. I need to put them out. I see. That makes so much more sense. I I thought the candles hurt me. So I was avoiding them. Like, no. I need to put them out in order to kill this guy. There we go. Alright, that guy was pretty easy, actually. Compared to the horse, anyway. I just needed to figure out what I was doing. What the hell? He's a guillotine. He was fantasizing about a guillotine. Okay, so what am I meant to do here? Do, am I meant to send them back at him? Also, he is really just sending heads at me. Okay, yeah, I am meant to just send them back at him. Okay. This is a bit weird, I'll say that much. It takes like two parries, I think, in order to kill them. In order to get one of the heads across the stage, it takes like two. There we go, alright. Alright, let's see. Hopefully it's not too difficult. Okay, so I have to fire. I can immediately see what I have to do. I have to fire. Oh my god, that is fucking fast. Okay. I get the gimmick. I immediately have gotten the gimmick of this. Oh, this is the queen. I see. This is the queen I saw in the in the credits. She's dropping a whole lot of things. There we go. Okay, first try. Maybe second try. I think it was the first try, though. She was actually pretty easy. Which I didn't expect. Defeat all of the King of Games champions. Hark to my new champions. The remaining spoils. And with that, the tournament has concluded. Henceforth, my castle shall remain a training ground for thee. Fare thee well, champions. Alright, well, that was easy, I guess. 
It wasn't actually as hard as I thought it was, anyway. Problem is, I still have no clue how to uh, do that uh, puzzle. I might just look it up in all honesty. I don't know if I can be asked. Oh, okay, I see. That is not a clear hint at all. I looked up what the hints were. Not like what the what the actual solution is. There's no way the others could have caught me in the dust. I left them and the, could have caught me. I left them in the dust. So like left. I'm not sure like top left. It's just, it just says left here. I left in a hurry and forgot my gear. I'll settle for second. I left downtown. Left down. Okay, so he's left down. It's down right. So left, left down, down right. Okay. Left, left down, down right. So it's like left, left down, down right. That is such a stupid thing. Take a little nap. Why not, honestly? Why not? T when I see a spiral into the sky, I think, why? okay, so the, the sand... What the fuck is this? What is this? What? What is this? What the fuck is this? What is this? Wish you may, wish you might, your soul is now trapped in the night. This is a literal acid trip. What the fuck is this? This is a literal acid trip of a fucking boss fight. What is this? And this is it. This is the entire fight because there was no, like, indicators or anything. Oh, it changes direct depending on what direction I'm looking. I see. I was so confused for a second there. Okay. So depending on what direction I'm looking in is which one I'm firing at. Okay, I get it. Oh, okay, so I need to... I see, I see, so I'm seeing so much right now. My eyes, my eyes, I see, I see it. Okay, so it only hurts me if I'm, if I'm looking in the direction it's going. Okay, well I see it though. I see what I'm meant to be doing. I think the, the toughest part is going to be executing it. But like, I did actually need to find out what I was doing. It was... <laughs> they do not tell you shit. They, they're they just like, here is a fucking fever dream of a level. What the fucking problem is that it fucking changes... Oh, I hate this. This actually is awful. It's a cool concept, but like, it just... It's so fucking hard. How am I meant to dodge that firebolt? How am I meant to dodge the firebolt if when I turn around in order to dodge it, there's a giant... Oh my god, you fucking stupid bitch. Like, how am I meant to dodge some of these? This is such poor shit. This is what I thought every single boss was going to be in this DLC. But actually, I, I liked most of the bosses in this DLC. Shit. There we go. Oh, thank God. Bitch is dead. Fuck that. That was so weird. Could it be? The fabled cursed relic, long thought lost to time, awoken at last. I've seen writings that say it despises bravery. Why would it despise bravery? With a greater foe, more evil shall go. What could it mean? Jinxed curio that inflicts various status ailments. Alright, so I just looked up what the cursed relic does. And it's pretty funny. So I'm going to test out, but I'm not testing out here because I wouldn't really get very far before I just kind of lost. I'm going to go to aisle one and I'm going to fight the root pack, but again. Why is the music 
if I take the music changes depending on if I'm wearing it that's honestly for good reason because uh, just watch this watch this I get one HP and every time I fire I get a random weapon and uh, honestly this is awesome I I'm gonna try beat the the root pack like this <laughs> this is awesome I love this actually if you just continuously fire nothing really happens <laughs> when you do when you use that <laughs> when you use your ultimus that's when shit really gets fucking weird oh, I tried to double jump that's cool though. I'm I'm gonna I'm really gonna try beat the root pack with this. Crack shot. I'm not letting go now. There we go. All right. Well, it's a pretty it's a pretty cool mechanic, I guess. That was some good DLC. Took me two hours, two two and a quarter hours, two hours fifteen minutes to get through everything, and I still haven't technically done everything. I'm missing this. But that's all the new bosses. I even did the secret boss, which honestly I don't, I didn't like. But I mean, I appreciate the fact that it, it exists. Uh, my favorite boss is definitely the dog one. This one was awesome. It's actually really fun. Uh, but my least favorite boss was definitely this cow woman. There was so many things happening, and it actually caused my brain to overload. I like the, I like the crack shot. The crack shot. I didn't test out the other weapons because I didn't have enough money uh, but I, I've seen them they seem they seem all right the twist up looks like the arc shot but like different slightly because it, it it doesn't come back down and stay on the floor that's cool crack shot is definitely as it says cracked as hell that is so good I love that weapon uh, this boss was the golem he was all right he, he really He's kind of forgettable though. I loved, I loved this one as well. The snow golem in the middle of that, that guy, so awesome. Loved him. I like the fact that they brought back a whole bunch of shit. This is just a, this is just a treasure trove of, of deleted bosses. And by that I mean there's two. There's the spider guy and the, the duke box just being in. They, they've combined them, which is cool. The twist at the end wasn't really that much of a twist. I kind of saw it coming, but it was still cool. It was still cool nonetheless. Overall, yeah, it was pretty good. It, it took me two hours. By 105, I was close. I was close to beating this with with less than 100 deaths. 105 is good though. I like. I, I'll I'll take that. So yeah, that that is Cuphead. That that's the entire game. I I doubt there'll be any DLC anytime soon. Uh, cause they, they literally just bought this one out, but it was good. No, I liked it. I can finally say I've beaten this game and all of the, the extra bosses. They didn't really take long, but I appreciate it and it was good. Thank you for watching and subscribe and I'll see you next time in whatever game I decide to play. I'm not going to sing that song again. I probably should have saved that for this time. It would have been more cinematic. Anyway, bye.